Hundreds of people came out waiting in this long line in 40 degree temperatures, filling up boxes and carts of meals during the Thanksgiving break. Happy Thanksgiving. Thank Happy Thanksgiving to you all. Yes, ma'am. A line that extended for a quarter of a mile. We normally have three football fields of people. I think we have five today. Ends with Miss Charlotte and her warm smile. We're out blessing the community with Antioch in the park for Thanksgiving. For six years in a row, Antioch for youth and family hands out food at MLK Park right before Thanksgiving break. If it wasn't for um, these kind of things, there would be a lot of hungry people out in the world. Rebecca Cahey is a single mother. She says this event means so much to her and her family. Without this foundation, I don't think we would be having Thanksgiving dinner this year. And with students out a few extra days for Thanksgiving break, Miss Charlotte says Antioch added three times the amount of protein this year. So on top of the turkey, um, they have hamburger patties, bacon, uh, chicken legs. And that's going to help out immensely, you know, because these little critters, they'll eat you out of house and home. <laughs> Honey, you better grab that box from the bottom. It's yeah, going to come yeah. out. As one person after the next made their way through the line, Miss Charlotte says none of this is possible without the community uniting. We can't achieve activities of this magnitude. So partnerships in any community and building that partnership element is critically important. Miss Charlotte from Antioch says every family will leave with about 100 pounds of food for this Thanksgiving. Reporting in Fort Smith, Tenzel Ashkin, 4029 News.